Hey everybody, I uh, decided to make my own plastic mulch layer. I was having a hard time finding one locally. They were very expensive to buy new. I don't have that large of a garden. For something I only need once a year, it was not a very feasible expense. I was renting one, but uh, that was out of state and they didn't want it crossing state lines for whatever agricultural reasons. So I made my own. I had an old toolbar that I bought from somebody. It's a diamond bar, which are kind of more rare than just regular square tubing. Diamond meaning they just mount it at an angle that makes it like a diamond instead of straight. But anybody can do this with a toolbar. Um, I bought some hardware for it. Uh, it came with some plows and some steel wheels. I was able to find uh, on eBay some attachments for the diamond bar and I bought some discs. I took off the steel wheels and used wheelbarrow tires and, um, and then for laying the plastic I inverted the plows and they had a half inch uh, holes in them so I bought a half inch piece of steel uh, rod, threaded steel rod from the hardware store and was able to feed that through. Um, the, it's four foot wide plastic I was able to um, run the PVC through the center of the plastic. It was two and three quarters, so I just got two inch PVC uh, with some end caps. Uh, I just drilled out the end caps. I put in a bearing, but it didn't really hold, so it didn't need it. Uh, so just I didn't even need to glue on the end caps. I just so just drill out the center of the end caps, slap it on there, run the rod through it, use some nuts and washers. And then the, the trickiest part is just adjusting your wheels and your disc settings, the depth um, and the angle of your toolbar on your tractor. This is just a 20 horsepower Mahindra. It's nothing crazy. You don't need a lot of, uh, a lot of tractor for a small setup like this. It does not shape the bed. The, the soil was very dry and I had tilled it. Um, it was very fluffy, just perfect conditions for this. Um, so I would definitely, you know, spend the time to, to work the soil ahead of time um, and get it nice and, and prepared. Uh, it kind of shaped the beds just from the disking. It, it worked out better than I anticipated. Um, I've tried doing it by hand, but we get some pretty ripping winds where I live in northern Utah, like 60 mile an hour, 70 mile an hour winds. And if there's any kind of opening, the wind will just take it. And so this did a really good job. Um, I didn't have any kind of attachment to lay out drip tape, so I, we just laid it by hand and then put the plastic on on top of it. Um, not hard to do. Um, I've included some pictures of kind of how my setup looked, and it worked great. So instead of spending a few grand on a plastic mulch layer, just build your own. Good luck. I believe this works. Looking good.